Hey guys, I'm Ashley Harrington for Red Carpet Report. We're in Beverly Hills at the 11th Annual Inspiration Awards. We talked to some fashionable ladies about who and what inspires them. How are you? I'm good, thank you. <laughs> I love your dress. Thank you. It's Halston. You know, which is funny because I, I thank God they, they are a part of this event because it's ne not a dress I would go to. And that's what I need. I need people to inspire me. Right. See, that's why I, I would need to be one of these girls. I need to be inspired. You need to be like, not the mentor, the mentee. Yeah, exactly. I'll be both. <laughs> Every day it changes. <laughs> I do like it though. It's really nice. Yeah, it's, it's very feminine. Yes. You know, and I don't really do ruffles, but I, it works. Yeah. I like it. So you're a petite. Do you have... Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, us petite girls, yes. So what trend would you say that petite girls should stay away from and which one should they embrace? I think that petite girls need to embrace their petiteness and stop trying to be tall. That's been my hardest lesson. The taller the heels, the more, the, the worse petite women lick, look, lick, Jesus. Hello, I haven't even started drinking. Um, yeah, I think that, you know, we need to embrace it. It's uh, being tall is not being beautiful. It's it's being grounded within yourself and owning it. And that's it. Own it. Just own it and be happy about it. Um, and what was the other question? <laughs> oh, trend for petite girls to embrace? Mm, I would say, well, embrace flats and stay away from wedges. Wedges? Yeah, how about that? That's a good one. Embrace flats, stay away from wedges, big wedges. I mean, I do a wedge, but it's got to be the, the, a small, a medium, not the, like, these crazy ones. Kitten heel size wedge, maybe? A little, you know, like, look. Oh, perfect. That's not very, that's not very high. Just enough, just enough, you know. I'm proud of my shortness. <laughs> so this is all about inspiration, and Pinterest is, like, so inspiring to everyone. Yes. I could spend hours. Are you a Pinterest fan? I am, and I, I I go into a deep dark hole when I get on Pinterest because I can't come out. I can't stop. I just keep looking and looking and looking. And days later, you're like, oh my god, I'm still looking. Yeah, and I've done nothing with my life except be inspired by other people and go, why didn't I think of that? Right? <laughs> right. Exactly. But I love it. I love that it exists. It's in. It's incredible. Yeah. I, without it, I wouldn't know how to cook. I wouldn't know how to do anything. Wow. That's good. See. It's a good thing for you. Yeah. <laughs> I had to get engaged, so I need to learn how to do all that stuff. Yeah. <laughs> so who inspires you? Right now, my daughter. She's six, but she inspires me because the way she sees the world is so untouched by all the things that we're affected by every day, and it reminds me that we all started there. So, got to get back to that. What advice would you give to her, like going into high school? It's only four years. It'll get better. <laughs> you won't remember this. You won't remember any of it. Once you're out, you don't remember it. It's over. It's done. Yeah. That well, thank you so much for talking to us. Well, that's it for us here in Beverly Hills. If you like the video, be sure to subscribe, like, leave us a comment letting us know who inspires you. I'm Ashley Harrington for Red Carpet Report.